I called the talk uh, How I Learned to Stop uh, Worrying and Love the Internet. Uh, back in a previous life, I used to be a film critic. One of my favorite uh, films was Stanley Kubrick's Dr. Strangelove, the subtitle of which is How I Learned to Stop Worrying and Love the Bomb. If you know the film, you'll know it's about the end of the world and everybody dies in the end. So that seemed like a suitably apocalyptic way to approach the subject. Um, for a website such as ours and for an organization such as ours, content is everything. Everything follows content. The business model follows content. The philosophy follows content. Everything is about content. But it's not just about translating traditional newspaper articles and ways of telling stories and reporting directly onto the internet. It's about finding new ways using audiovisual, using data, and using the concept of live in a way that we've never dealt with before. But it's all about the content. Newspapers face the biggest challenge in their history. Newspapers have been around for two or three hundred years and they have never faced the level of business challenge that they do right now. The reality is that most newspapers which you see at the moment won't exist in printed form in 20 or 30 years time. I'm not going to put an exact number on it, it's very difficult to know exactly what way it's going to pan out. But our, uh, our business and our, uh, our activities are being technologically disrupted in a way that we couldn't have anticipated in previous generations. And only the smartest and fittest and most skillful will survive. Actually, before I was a journalist, I worked in film and television production, and the most important single thing that I learned there was that uh, a single hour spent in preparation will save you 10 hours when you're actually doing the thing. So it's cheaper and easier and smarter to prepare properly.